Okay, so small reminder before I start my video, please subscribe if you are interested and leave a comment to help improve my video. Thanks. Okay, we are back with Soft Drizzle. Look at that bunny outfit. Oh. <laughs> Why? All right then, let's yeah, let's just get outside then wearing that bunny outfit. Still feel it's a little too revealing though. Yeah, it is. <laughs> ah. So cute. Yep. So wholesome, the three of you. So the first time I play this game, I thought it was a horror game, but apparently it isn't. It's just the story of these three ado adorable uh, friends. Anyway, we have a few hours of festival left. Sure. Let's do something else. Alright. The escape room. Halloween festival, 8.17pm. Are we supposed to... Oh, okay. Then what should we do? Aha, the escape room. The one your dad told us about. Oh yeah, sounds pretty radical. Uh -huh. We could give it a go. Let's do it. It's gonna be amazing. Okay, that's good. Oh, they're so adorable. Lovely. Alright, uh, a quick coup. Cool. How do you read it? Kue, kue. Kuo, kuo. Kuo? Never mind. There's a lot of people waiting to enter the escape room. Definitely. I mean, it's a festival. Yes, I was afraid this was gonna be the case. This escape room is the year's main attraction after all. So, yeah. Naturally, it's going to be flooding with people. Such a shame. Shame indeed. Yep. Let's wait though. We have already visited, mo visited most of the festival and I have this feeling this is going to be super fun. Besides, if there are so many people waiting for it, it's probably probably worth it. Worth it, yeah. Uh sure. <laughs> Why not? Yeah, in any case I in any case I really want to go in. Alright then. I've never been to an escape room and I have always wanted to. Okay, let's wait. Yay! Oh boy, I'm so excited for this. I used to love web-based escape room games. I excelled at them. Years ago though. <laughs> Why? They then suddenly stopped being popular and kinda disappear. Uh-huh. Due to that web technology disappearing. That one. Which one? Adobo Flash. Alright. Yeah. Ah, yes. You know, I used to really used to love to play, you know, those Adobo Flash game, but such a shame that now it has been pulled off. I don't know, can we still play Flash game? Huh. I'll have to check it out later. There are some Flash game that I enjoy playing with then. Such a shame indeed, I really like those games. Web based games are not the same nowadays. People prefer playing on their phones and... I mean that is alright but... Or to each their own, but... Aha, uh -huh. that's what I've been waiting for. But I really miss the golden age of web based games. Yeah, me too. I don't play much anymore but I used to spend my... Afternoons playing browser game when I was younger. Some were actually pretty good. Such a pity. Uh huh. Oh, transitioning, that's why. We talked for a while about web based games. Then our conversation shifted to food. <laughs> okay. And Halloween stuff, and before we knew it, it was our turn to enter the escape room. Uh-huh. 
We are next. We are next. At last. How many is your... How many in your party, mill lady? Three. It is... It is us three. Great, come on in. I'll explain the rules to you. Who need rules? We, we're just gonna smash the wall and break through. <laughs> Escaping. Welcome to the Halloween Festival Escape Layer. 20 minutes to exit this room? Aha, uh -huh. scary. You may find items and clues scattered across the room. You can interact with objects in the room by clicking them. You can pick items up by clicking them and you can select them on your toolbar to equip them. Aha, uh -huh. alright then. Aha. Uh -huh. You can use the item with that object. For example, you can use a key to open the door. Yeah, that, um, that is. I already know that. Any questions? No questions. Okay then. Aha, uh -huh. backstory first. Count Manul, the vampire, has captured you three and trapped you in his evil lair. Aha! Uh -huh. Scarier, spooky. 20 minutes from now, the moon will be at its highest and he'll feast on your blood. Okay, a little too scary. <laughs> Who you call? Sorry. You have to escape the Count's lair before then. Good luck. Good luck indeed. Aha, uh -huh. whoa, it looks really looks like one of those dungeons, except uh, what's that? That's a uh, very modern for this kind of dungeon. Count Manure sure is a. Uh, not Manure. <laughs> Manul is sure is a technological person. Are we supposed to. Oh, okay. Still not. Ooh, this is so scary. Are you really that scared? No, but I love the mood they have set for this room. So far, it was worth the wait. This is so cool. Okay, enough chit chat. We have less than 20 minutes before the count savage us all. Let's get out of this place. Yay! <laughs> okay. Exploration time. What? Uh. Oh. Okay, I'm uh, taking a drink break back then so apparently we can see those objects that are highlighted interesting oh we can see the highlight I mean so we can know which object we can interact with a candle so it needs to be lit interesting we have to be fast a save uh-huh yeah uh, let's let's get out what huh obviously if it's the right number on the first try it's Kinda impressive. Okay, so what's this? Aha, the door is closed, preventing our escape. It has a key hole though. Maybe a key? Yeah, obviously. Let's look around for a key. Can we use the fire to lit the candle? No. Alright then. Aha, another candle. Yep, I can see that clearly. Is that an AC? Air conditioner? Poster on the wall. Ah, interesting. Weird re rectangle with smaller rectangle inside. What could it mean? Maybe it's not a rectangle. Something else. Could be. Stars and... I don't understand. What are we looking at? A building? Big chest. Let's examine it. Uh, under the coat. So, no. Uh, huh. Ah, oh, it's still in the same room. Ah, oh, little box. Single match. Alright, I'm pretty sure I know where we have to go. Re... What? Aha. Uh -huh. Minus 5 plus 3 minus 5. Super weird. Alright then, so let's lit up the thingy. Oh yeah, it's the door. Oh, oh, okay, what's this? Oh, that's a door. Yeah, I, I, I already know. Oh, that's the chest, again. 
Okay, there's actually nothing to interact with here, so yeah, let's just light a candle. Uh huh. Why don't we just use the fire right there? Ooh, spooky! The flames blue. Aha! Uh -huh. That should. Yeah, this the map, the poster. Oh, I thought it will be lighted up. Oh, okay, something on the wall. What could this mean? Three, two, six, five. Three, two, six, five. Is that it? Let's try it. Three, two, six, five. Oh, all right. Very interesting. Okay, so I gave up. Uh, I've been searching for quite some time and confused of what the thing are apparently. To open the chest, we yeah we have to figure out the number here. It's actually not rectangles, which is obvious, but numbers. But I don't understand where do the number comes from. It's supposed to be this. Let's see. Eight, two, six, five, isn't it? Oh, wrong. Uh, and what is it? I forgot. Oh no. <laughs> ah, all right. It's eight two six three. Yep, it opened. But how? Eight two. Uh, is it because that it looks like you know eight and then two and then six three? Uh, I don't know. Does it? Uh, okay, let me know in the comment section if you figure it out, because I don't. A sheet of paper. Something right on. Plus one, plus four. Ah, it must be the thingy. Plus one, plus four, three, five. Super weird. Must be related to this domino thing i try not to look at a clue anymore because there's quite some separate clue i only see the chest one because i'm confused oh wait it's actually so plus one plus four isn't it uh-huh four six three ten yeah five zero four six Four six ten. All right then. Is that it? I, I'm trying not to look at the code at all. All right. Uh, what is it then? It's three. Oh my god. Dum dum. So it should be yeah. It's not pan. I write it. What do I write it at? Wait, I'm confused. Alright, so... Okay, 3 plus any 4, then this one should be 6. Why do I write it as that? And this one should be 1, like that. That's what I was supposed to input back then. Because I think it is this, but... That's not a 4. Not a 10, so... It's a 3, so it's a 9. Bingo! Aha, uh -huh, a key. Alright then, let's get out. Definitely. I mean, there's nothing else to solve here. Yes, it is open. Finally! <laughs> we are free! Alright then, let's get out. Ah, Halloween Festival, 8.59pm. 
Finally, we are free. That's it? Yeah, that's all. Kinda confusing though. <laughs> we did it. Yay! We escaped from the Count Manul layer. We did it. Indeed, you all did it. So much fun. Much better than the online games, I love it. Was really fun, haha. <laughs> so... What next? Next? Well, all this festival and escape room stuff has made me hungry. Yeah, I know it. <laughs> and I couldn't even finish my ice cream before, so... Well, you ate half of mine. <laughs> Did I? In any case, do you want to grab a bite? Sure, I do. I love to. There's an amazing burger place not too far away. They make some glorious curly, curly fries with cheddar, cheese and bacon. Ooh, that is delicious. <laughs> Why does she start screaming? Uh huh, drooling just from hearing you talk. Love french fries, my god. Follow me then. To the french fries, you gonna love this place. How come you know all this place, Himari? Hmm, that is easy. Alright. <laughs> Alright then. Aha. Uh -huh. So they are gonna be eating? We followed Himari to the burger place she, ha she had told us about, and just like she had said, it was amazing. We ate the best burgers we had eaten in our life. We ordered tons of curly fries with cheddar cheese and bacon, and we drank lots of soda and had lots of fun. How many calories do you <laughs> do you people eat? Uh huh. We talk a lot. We love a lot. We had finished eating. We went back to the park. Oh, it's already empty. Almost deserted. Being kind of late, most of the people who had come to the festival had already left. With less light bathing all in their orange glow, a clean starry sky shone above us. What am I supposed to do? Can I interact with something here? Wait, there's no music at all and... Uh, suspicious. Huh. Oh. You. It's kind of creepy that you're standing there just like that. Himari. Hello. Oh. <laughs> Freaking hell, I knew it. <laughs> I knew you were gonna jump scare us. Shall we go, girls? Yes, let's get going. It's getting a little late even for me. Aha, uh -huh, let's go. Indeed, let's go. <laughs> Love that small addition of jump scare though. We changed back into our clothes, stored the costume away, and then we helped him our dad carry all the boxes back to their store. Once we were done, Himari and her dad thanked us once more for assisting them, and Fuyoki and I took the metro home. Uh huh. Feel completely asleep. Fell completely asleep. Had been a really tiring day. Ah, had been very fun too. Enjoyable one. We dressed up, we ate a lot, we talked a lot, and we laughed a lot. And I hope next year we can do it again. I sure love spending time with my friends. Ah, oh, sweet. Sweet dreams. The end. Soft Drizzle Beat Track. A tiny visual novel by Lardu. Not so tiny considering uh, how long do I play. <laughs> Music and character art also by me. Woo! Lardu and me. Who is me? I also made the 3D scenes. Lardu, alright? Mm -hmm. By Lardu and Sanjay. <laughs> Visit me at www.lardu.net. Follow me on Twitter, already done! 2020 Thank you for playing. Very enjoy a very enjoyable visual novel indeed. Lovely. Oh, 
We are back at the oh I just skip the Can we? Aha, uh -huh, we can. Okay, so that's all for soft drizzle B track. It was a pretty not it's actually not short, it's quite you could say yeah actually it is short. Or long, I don't know. Or medium, short or medium. That's all for Soft Drizzle B track. A very lovely visual novel, wholesome, telling the story of three friends going on to a Halloween party. Not a Halloween party, it is, is it a Halloween party? Yeah. It is so adorable to see them three interact with each other, loving it. Such a sweet friendship. So that's all for Soft Drizzle. See you later in my next video then. Bye bye.